was the most surprising thing for you as you're writing over four years this incredible book? What was the most surprising thing that you learned about Robert that you didn't know before? You don't ask easy questions. <laughs> uh, the most surprising thing. I knew about his, you know, his life with me, which most people didn't know, except his very closest friend, is that he can be goofy. He can, you know, strut around the house singing My Wild Irish Rose or, or Give My Regards to Broadway. Uh, he can be very shy. Uh, he can be a lot of different people. And I kept, the reason, I, I kept journals since I've been in college. This is a memoirist's dream. Um, I'm so glad I did it because I could refer to the, the uh, journals. And there were things in the journals that only exist in the journals because we did not remember either of us doing these things. <laughs> so we, we went through them and uh, I made an agreement with Bob my, at my insistence that he read everything that I write in, in draft form as the drafts, uh, he was pretty sick of it after a while, but um, each draft he would have to read and approve. Uh, he uh, would sometimes say, this is not right. It didn't happen this way. I'd flip through my journals, and I'd come out, and, I'd, and he'd say, oh, all right. I guess it did. Uh, he, he is a, Bob is a very laissez-faire man, a very accepting person, and he uh, wanted me, as he said, to write the memoir to write my own story of him. Uh, and he, it was very hard to tell when he was not pleased about something that I wrote. Uh, most people will tell you right out, ah, oh, no, no, don't do that, you don't do this. He was, you had to watch him to see if a, a <coughs> muscle twitched here or the batting of the eyes, or some indication that he had some feelings about the passage or the segment or the, the chapter that I had done. And then I would ask him, uh, well, what do you think of it? And he said, fine, it's fine, it's your memory. And I said, oh, OK. So what's wrong with it? <laughs> and uh, so we, we would, I would have to tease it out of it, really. And uh, this was one of the most surprising things, I think, because I never thought that somebody as private as Bob is and as unemotional to the public and as unemotional to himself. I mean, sometimes he doesn't even know the emotions he's feeling uh, because he's been brought up that way and he's worked that way as a prosecutor. So I was surprised that, that he would be so forthcoming 